Hey guys, Andres here from Graphic Bible and on today's video I'm going to show you a quick tutorial about animating gradients in After Effects so you can use it for your Instagram stories or for other kind of videos and it's pretty easy, I will show you step by step so let's get right into it Okay guys, so the first thing that we're going to do is to create a composition. So you want to click here or just go to Composition, New Composition. And then you can name it however you want. I'm just going to name it uh, Moving Gradients for now. And then for the size, uh, it depends on the, the format that you need, but in this case I'm going to, to use it for Instagram stories, so it will be 1080 by 1920, and the frame rate 24 is fine, and the duration I will leave it like this, 15 seconds, and click OK. If you are not sure about the colors that you want to use, you can search for images on, on Pinterest and then we can import it into After Effects. So just pick an image from Pinterest or Dribbble. They have a lot of cool greens that you can use for this animation. Okay, in order to import the image, you just right click, import file. And we're gonna select the image that we download from Pinterest. Make sure footage is selected and click import. After that we're gonna create a solid. So just right click a new solid. And you can name it however you want. In this case we're gonna name it gradient one. And for the color, it doesn't matter right now, just click OK or, or press Enter. And we're going to grab next the, the image above our gradient. So we're going to choose the colors from this image. So make sure it's smaller than the actual size of your solid. And we're going to search for an effect called for color gradient. And we're going to apply that to the, to the solid. You can just drag it and drop it. So as you can see, it gives you four points. And we can change those points very easily with the eyedropper tool. So you just click this eyedropper and start selecting the colors from the image within. And repeat the process with all of, the, of your points. So in this case, I'm going to use these kind of colors. As soon as you're happy with the result, we can just hide this and duplicate this. So just press Ctrl D on your keyboard or Command D on your keyboard, and we can rename this to Gradient 2. And make sure the blending mode is lighting. If you don't see this, you just click here. It will give you the, the blending mode. Okay. So for the next step, we're gonna drag the, the timeline in the beginning of the animation and we're gonna start clicking the points. So in this stopwatch, click all the points, in this case are four. And in order to see it in the timeline, you're gonna press U on your keyboard. So press U and let's move like around 3 seconds and we're going to start making more uh, keyframes. And the ideal animation is to move all the points in between the, the keyframes. So I'm just going to start moving this guy down here. And we're gonna repeat the process with the other points. You can just move it however you want. If you want to change the colors, you can do that too. So just start dragging and playing with the settings, with the colors, sorry, to see which one you like more. And we're gonna repeat the same process every uh, three seconds.
So if you want to change the speed of your animation, you can do that too. So just select all the keyframes and holding down Alt on your keyboard, and just start moving the frames. So it will be faster animation. Okay, so for the last part, I just add a, a cool text, and that's it. This is the result. I hope you guys enjoyed this short tutorial about animated ingredients. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel, give it some thumbs up, and see you in the next video.